it could have ended up real bad. For Adam Diaz, the thought of his commute home Thursday night is just scary. Still makes him nervous. He had just exited off the 8 and onto the 67. I noticed the black Honda coming up. When a speeding car moved in front of him. And then I saw what appeared to be a hand with a two-liter bottle of soda or something coming out the back window. Diaz says the bottle was thrown, hit a truck, and then launched. It went at least three lanes. I mean, rather fast, too, because I just saw the impact and then just, just took off like a rocket. He says the bottle <laughs> smashed the back window of a white sedan, causing the driver to slam on the brakes. At the same time, an odor flying into Diaz's vents. And I could just smell the vinegar coming in. I had to roll down the windows because it was very, uh, uh, very strong. When he got home, he got a closer look at just what was all over his SUV. A clear, milky substance. And it was covering the whole front of the car, mainly on this side. That reminded him of YouTube videos like this. Let's just try. When vinegar and baking soda are turned into dangerous bottle bombs. The possibility of a bottle bomb led Diaz to post his story on Facebook to warn drivers and the culprit. They just need to stop and then uh, realize what they're doing is harmful. I mean, they could kill someone. Michael Chen, 10 News. Now dangerous. Diaz says that he didn't call police because he didn't get a good look at the driver. He says the car was a Honda Accord with a bumper sticker that read, I heart dogs.